Hello, testing. Perfect. We are back for some more Disgaea. Some more Disgaea uh, 5. That's this game. I remember the name of it. Thank you. I'm, I'm the best. Uh, I feel like my input level has changed again. Thank you, Windows. I don't know how to... how to make you d work all the time. Uh, that's fine, now. I realized the other day when I was recording my uh, my SMT uh, catch-up that just playing it directly in the OBS window without pass-through is, is more than good enough for me. Chat window stayed the same. There we go. Thank you, chat window. I can see stuff. Yeah, so it's Wednesday. It's not a normal stream day. Experiment. But as you can tell, almost everybody is higher than level 400. So I would like to... Uh, do some story stuff here. Let's go. And I was uh, finishing up Item World. And I was like, well, instead of waiting another 15 minutes to spin up Item World and then uh, make an excuse to not stream, let's just tear off the band-aid for this, so to speak. Okay. Let me just do a quick rotation of the mic. Maybe that'll fix it. Hopefully that fixes it. No? I don't know. Oh no, I have it mixed down a little bit because it was too super hot. Okay. This should be good, I hope. Should be better. I'm trying to keep it out of the red. So maybe that's why I had it mixed down like that. Even my strongest character with one of his strongest attacks can't one hit her. Actually, can we get better bonuses out of you? Really better. Oh, Abby, I just realized you, uh, you brought me two bowls because you know how I like to eat the eat cashews. Oh, the peanuts, yeah. Through. 
So the way I like to eat them is I like to... Uh, shuck them quite often. Lick the shell a bit to get some of the salt from the outside. And then I put it in a different uh, receptacle of slightly licked shells. So I end up having two bowls to uh, do my business with. Yeah, we need to go to uh, Serafina's home planet next. Just mostly look for either really high level items or something that says new. Let's fix you up. What? We'll just uh Fly through some of these boss fights. Oh no, boss fights. Just uh, Wanna see? Wanna good see? clean uh, exploration. You have to heal them up after the expeditions. I don't think anybody was particularly hurt. This is it. Take this, dude. 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 I haven't made extracts out of these people yet in a while. Thank you, Melody. Thank you, Loka. Thank you, Willow. Thank you, Gorilla Press. Thank you, Reba. Thank you, Christy. Thank you, Hugo. Thank you, Pink. Thank you, Mature. Thank you, Dr. Zan. Thank you, Master of Kick. Thank you, Husband. Thank you, Jokomo. Thank you, Insert Name. Thank you, Go Ahead and Ask. Thank you, Vice. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, Chang. Thank you, Ren. Thank you, Lee. Thank you, Diane. Thank you, Husband. Thank you, Mel. Thank you, Paint Collection. Thank you, Kennedy. Thank you, Slugger. Thank you, Nina. Thank you, Other Husband. Thank you, Peha. Thank you, Allie. Thank you, Another Husband. Thank you, Savings. Thank you, Val. Thank you, Xtina. Thank you, Other Husband. Thank you, 300-year-old Cheater. Thank you, Elise. Thank you, Safari James. Thank you, Nicholas. Thank you, Brendan. Thank you, Johanna. Thank you, Kathleen. Thank you, Mr. X. Thank you, Peter. Thank you, Ringo. Thank you, Tia. Thank you, Maya. Thank you, Jasper. Thank you, Whitney. Thank you, Sharna. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Guillermo. Thank you, Mila. Thank you, Gorgonzola. Thank you, Benjamin. Thank you, Christina. Thank you, Henderson. Thank you, President Ronnie. Thank you, Joanne. Thank you, Jeremy. Thank you, Rand. And no thank you, Undercover Cop. Okay. Now let's combine them all down to one, uh... Condense in all those magic ex extracts. Yeah, I have it. Let me thank you. Goodness, fragments of power. We could do that too. I, I, I. Let me thank you. Uh. 
Uh, I think they're in this consumable area. Yeah. So right now I have this magic extract I have will just immediately gain somebody over 2,000 stats. That'll give you 3,500, 3,500, 2,700, 3, So. We're in a good spot, actually. Ooh. Starting to run out of space. I like to try and keep that under a thousand. It sort of uh, sneaks up on you. La la la, la la la, la 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 la. I just want to make sure I have the order set, yeah. Everyone's properly sorted. Yeah, right now my lowest characters are 370. Might have to switch to uh, sitting my strongest people out so I can start bringing the people at the bottom into some high experience missions. A novices. I am Salvatore. Back to the prison planet of Gorgeous. Too clean. I sense something too. This place isn't the same as what I saw through my clairvoyance. Besides, most netherworlds have been invaded by the lost and turned into ruins. Gorgeous, on the other hand, seems unusually pristine. I would imagine this place would be targeted first since it's so wealthy, Cliff. I don't know how to say this, but... Sorry, sis. This is the truth behind Gorgeous. This is what I saw through my clairvoyance. Whoa, whoa, Sarah! What is going on here? I feel like the first wall got broken, not even the fourth wall. Silence! There is a deep and profound reasoning for this that's... Much longer than Dragon Overlord Babylon himself!
Did the lost get to it already? No, that's not it. As I said, there is a deep and profound reason. Oh, damn it! This is why I said I didn't want to come back here! Are they the lost? No, they're bodyguards my father hired. Enemies. I'm relieved for it. No, they're my father's bodyguards. They won't hesitate to attack anyone who trespasses. special things happening? I guess not. Uh, just some laughables, gotcha. The worst part of this is uh, not letting one of my characters be usable. How is she not able to kill them? I guess her attack is relatively weak. Flip. We have curry or no? We have chili tomorrow. Abby, flip. Guess the level don't matter if your raw stats are low, right? What's my name? She's going rabid. Not the Ubisoft property. But like, ah. Good job, Usalia and Peta. Whew. Looks like we handled those bodyguards. They attacked us even though we came here to save Gorgeous. What kind of stuff did you teach them, Sarah? I don't want to hear that coming from a muscle-headed idiot who was betrayed by his own underlings. I was prepared for some consequences. Let's just focus on the reason we came here in the first place. Yes! Where is the magical spear flip? According to my clairvoyance... Huh? Where is this? to defeat Void Dark. 
I have no choice. Hey, Sarah, what are you doing? Silence! Could you not talk to me? I'm searching. Searching? What are you looking for, sis? Found it. Prinnies? This is... For good reason. This is the entrance to the castle. Since I'm already here, I don't care anymore. Now, please witness the reality of my gorgeous world. Is all a facade? Literally and figuratively? you're an intruder this looks like a little version of the ship that we're the pocket dimension that we're generally in yes just like that a solid steel fortress protected by advanced security systems correct this is the colossal underground shelter that my father spent the entire fortune of this netherworld to build A shelter? Why did he build it? The reason, of course, is all because of Demon Emperor Void Dark. My father was a coward to begin with, but he was one of the first to sense the threat Void Dark posed. And my father predicted that he wouldn't leave the richest netherworld in all the three worlds alone, so he built this shelter. This fortress, you'd be safe, Flip? If that had been guaranteed, then my father wouldn't have tried to make me marry Void Dark. What's that supposed to mean? After my father completed the shelter, he was still extremely worried, so he tried to improve it every day. Because of that, I convinced my pitiful father to let me take over the title of Overlord. With my Baylor gaze. That goes beyond convincing. Even though I achieved the title of Overlord, he was still worried. And then, he finally made the worst decision yet. Which was the arranged marriage. Oh, wow. What an awful dad. I was outraged, and although I'm the Overlord, I left home and decided to assassinate Boy Dark. You got in over your head. What were you planning to do if you hadn't met me? At that time, I was still an inexperienced princess. I thought I could surely use my overload skill, Baylor Gaze, to turn Void Dark into my servant. <laughs> you 
sure are confident. But what if your highly praised Baylor gaze doesn't work against Void Dark? Madam Serafina, you're the best. Madam Serafina, you're the best. Madam Serafina, you're the best. No man in this universe can resist the seductive glare of my Baylor gaze. Well, except for Sir Killia. He's immune to it. Does it work against Killia, Flip? Why is that? I don't know. As a matter of fact, it's not something that I'd like to admit. My father must have noticed our intrusion. Everyone, please be careful. Since my father is a coward, he'll eliminate all intruders, no matter how much it'll cost. In this case, we need to meet Serafina's father quickly so that we can explain ourselves. So, is the area safe because of the... Magnus back to normal first? Which I call it the spear, or will it still the spear still destroy this area? Seems like they should still be worried. Hi. Please excuse me. I don't know what protection beam does. It... A laser attacks the lo mark location at end of turn. Okay. Uh... Fine. We can live with this. Let's go. There's on the off chance I gain a level or two. Now, what should I do? This guy is definitely not a demon. <laughs> Winky face. Will I have a target height problem? Negative. Huh. Love to see it. Or just preventing me from camping, I guess. Don't have anything for that range, do I? Okie doke. This would be an interesting mechanic if it's uh, 
if it increased the number of squares that it affected. So either it does like a wider radius or it lays down on more areas. I think that will let me get them both, right? Uh, not quite. Any muskets in here? Nope. Look like it's getting noticeably larger. I got your hands full down here, don't you? Got him. Hello, Good Peta. job, Peta, Izuna, and Etna. Whole bunch of girl bosses there. We came here to destroy the last magical spear. We don't have time for a pointless fight. That's right, Blint. There's no reason for us to fight anyone who isn't a member of the Lost Blint. My, how much trouble does my cowardly father plan to cause for us? Father, you're an idiot! That voice, is it my daughter, Serafina's? Father? Ooh, you've returned. It's all right, bodyguards, stand down. atrocious looking guy left oh you truly are Serafina I'm glad you've come back father Gah? that's sis's pops 
monocle ogre. are merely camouflage to protect himself it's a simple trick if he looks scary fewer enemies will try to invade us he used to be a refined gentleman with gray hair but he modified himself as you can see he's completely unrecognizable for a coward he's quite hardcore he's willing to go to great lengths <laughs> You became a coward when you got too attached to money. Serafina, you came back. Does this mean you've made your decision? About what? Is this about the arranged marriage, or did I forget the plotline of this game already? Void dark, of course. If you two tie the knot. We can strike an alliance with the lost. Ooh. Then, Gorgeous won't be destroyed. Father, there's no time for that. Void Dark launched a magical spear that should have landed somewhere in this netherworld. We need to destroy. Yes, yes, don't worry about that. It wasn't able to pierce through my steel fortress. It was lying around on the floor. The magical spear couldn't pierce the castle foot? It must be sturdy. And just where might that magical spear be right now? I thought it would fetch a high price, so I stored it in the throne room. It's dangerous. The magical spear absorbs energy until it's destroyed. Let's hurry up and check out the throne room. W wait a second. Who do you think you are trying to enter the throne room without permission? I don't even know who you are. I won't allow it. me to introduce you father this is sir Kilia, my fiance whoa they're not married or engaged really when'd you guys get engaged bro everyone listen just play along hey hold on I haven't heard any of this. I won't allow you to marry anyone other than Void Dark. Father, Sir Kilia was once the feared tyrant overlord Kilidia. Do you still object to our union? T tyrant overlord Kilidia? The overlord of Cryoblood? I heard he died. Sir Kilia will surely defeat Void Dark, so there is no longer any need for that other marriage. Hmm, Tyrant Overlord Kilidia. Whoa, whoa! This guy's seriously thinking it over now. You're really gonna have to marry your Kilia. I'm speechless. My guests, I need to have a word with my daughter regarding her future, so would you please excuse us? What do you want to talk about? If it's about the marriage, then I refuse. It's not that. Gorgeous is currently in great danger. I already know that. That's why we came to destroy the magical spear. I don't care about the magical spear. 
Something even worse is happening. What is it? Gorgeous, the richest nation in all of the three worlds, is financially bankrupt. What? All of Gorgeous's wealth is gone. I've invested it all to construct this colossal underground shelter. Zero cash, zero art, and zero jewelry. I've sold and spent it all. This is why you can't put every penny you have into your house. You can put down a big down payment like I did, but you need to have reserve because the air conditioning and heating isn't going to work very well. You might need to get some trenches re redone for your French drains. Tree, tree maintenance and work. I am now poor? Uh, uh, are you going to shoot your father? Killing me won't change the fact that you're poor. No! <laughs> this is only a dream. Yes, it must be a dream. Serafina, do you hate being poor? Of course! Yes, I hate it too. That is why we need to turn the people you brought with you over to the lost. Tyrant Overlord Kilidia and the Scorching Storm Overlord Red Magnus, all of them would fetch a high price. What are you saying, Father? I'm fine with selling out that musclehead Red Magnus, but Sir Kilia is my fiance. Who cares? I've been tricking all of the overlords and Majins who wanted to marry you and stole all of their valuables. W what did you say? There's nothing wrong with that. I wanted to give you a good life, so I've been using you as bait to make money. No. Tell me that's a lie. That makes sense to me. I did it all for you. You don't want to be poor, do you? W well... Then it's settled. You're going to be helping me. Obviously, it's about marrying Kilia. Perhaps there's been a surprise turn of events and they're planning the ceremony. Stop it. That's not funny. But she'd be a sugar mama. It might not be that bad after all, bro. Then you do it for me. I don't have enough lives to endure that. <laughs> there aren't a lot of guys who can break that fucking Bronco. Who are you calling a fucking Bronco? Serafina, are you all right, Blitz? Did your father scold you? How's it going, Teddy? We're just uh, doing some Sky 5 tonight because I was drinking a little bit of soju and I wanted to uh, get through some of the story since there's a ton of grinding in this game. Of course, I'm fine. With my Baylor gaze, convincing Hope my you're doing is well on a Wednesday. That's not called convincing.
Are you sure you're okay? You don't look so good. Just a quick recap. Serafina, that pink-haired girl on the right, we are in her kingdom, her demon world, because uh, some demon called Dark Zero, which Kilio used to train with, and they fought over his sister. Uh, well, his lover, Dark Zero sister. And uh, now he's trying to destroy all these demon worlds, and he's targeting like pretty much everybody in the party's worlds. And uh, we're on Seraphina's planet now. She was known to be super beautiful and super rich and super posh. And it turns out that her dad squ squandered all the money to build this fortress. And she he wants to sell her off to, uh, to Dark Zero. Sir Kilia, are you worried about me? To hydrate and stretch. Ugh. I've been sitting in a chair for like the last nine hours. Uh oh. My Oshi and my wife are talking. He's worried about a person like me. It's pointless to worry about a penniless pauper like me. Plus, I am trying to sell you all out to the lost to become rich again. I absolutely refuse to be poor. Because, because I am the overlord of gorgeous. My brilliant and dazzling netherworld. I'll become the devil herself if that's what it takes to get my elegant lifestyle back. I really need to clean up my desks and do proper cable management. So I can move my desk into its standing position sometime in the next year I don't even want to think about losing Sir Kilia and my other wonderful ally I mean servants I think all the health studies I read are essentially people sitting in desk jobs or killing themselves doing it as in you're just uh humans aren't set to like sit built to sit and crouch for like 12 plus hours a day. And I work from home, so sure I okay? sit at my desk and work, and then Abby pulls me away for some meals or to watch something. <laughs> now, let's go destroy the magical spear. But I just don't get the uh, sort of the random walking around nice. that I would in the uh, in the actual office. Yeah, I do need to get off the PC more. So in addition to cleaning up my desk in my room to Today's make everything more Give us what you promised. make everything more standing desk ready I'm also probably going to spend more time in the next couple weeks building like model kits because we built up a pretty good collection of them Abby got me some uh, she got me some nice stands and some nice tools to help build them Your father has been for Christmas and at least that's, uh, at least I'm, well, I'm still sitting at the table, but I'm not at a computer. I'm not hunched over staring at a screen. Unpaid workers? That's unacceptable. Paying the workers is the employer's job. Oh, we're gonna go on a printing strike, I think. What are you guys doing? You're rich. Just hurry up and pay them, sis. And I don't know if Abby's been counting, but I... I am getting back to the, uh... We want you to pay us all right now, dude. I am getting back to my rowing machine, and I'm trying to make sure I at least do 15 minutes every day on it. Which isn't a lot, but... Six cans of sardines for half a year? If I can... Salary is one can a month? If I can sustain 15 minutes every day of pretty good heart rate and exercise, that's... That's a good place to be. What a sweatshop... No. A sweat netherworld. Well, we're talking for any wages here. That seems about right. Yeah, Abby, I just I just been doing fifteen minutes uh, so far every day this week to build a habit. I don't even have a 
doesn't need to be the most strenuous workout. I don't need to be dying afterwards. I don't need to like hurt my leg. But I just need to be, you know, staying active. Uh, I can't believe this, dude. You're just using us. Unfair practices. Please do. If something happens to my view count will be negative one. That's not acceptable. Don't worry, Teddy. Case, if something happens to me, multiple computers will still log into your stream. So, as long as the power stays on, you'll be fine. I will say I'm absolutely shocked that Teddy came by. She's such a busy person with her own stream, and she's so much bigger than me. It is a real treat to even have her say hi for a minute. I just hit resort so we can try and get multiple groups going here. Anybody who's watching now or in the VOD, you should go check out Teddy Sunday as well. I've been watching her play for a while. She's a variety streamer, and she, I think she did Fate of Resonance most recently as like a longer form game. She was last playing Carry On. My true power. She is very funny and very active and very talkative during streams. She is a real honest to goodness, goodness streamer. And she's funny and she has a discord that I, I'm not always the most active in, but every time I walk in and say hi, everybody's like, oh, John's here. That's just the group of people she's uh, cultivated. No, dude. Yeah. Huh. Yahoo, dude. Wanna die, dude? No. We have a pretty uh yeah. Abby and I have a pretty nice Valentine's Day plans. I will I will share true pictures in your Discord so people can be very jealous. I will uh I'll I'll share I'll share some pictures of the food afterwards. We're pretty much just going to just have Amazingly nice restaurants. We're actually going with uh, one of our mutual friends who was our uh, a bridesmaid at our wedding and someone we've uh, played been, been playing PUBG with for a while. So it's like a devil's valentines. It's not, it's not, I don't know, it's not super intimate, but like when I was trying to get reservations for stuff. The only option was a table of four, no, and yet to pay for every seat. And I'm like, well, I can barely afford <laughs> to pay two seats of this, no, let alone four. So, how the heck do I just jump down? I guess I just jumped down. These uh, these penguins are called. They are exactly like penguins, except they are the souls of people who've done bad. And now they are used, like very literally, for for slave labor in the demon world. Uh, they legally have to end every sentence with dude. That's why you hear them say, oh, dude, a lot. So... 
another thing that you, oh no lifting that sucks i was gonna say the other thing about them is uh if you throw them they explode but i can't lift because there's a environment for them I normally blasted the animations, but we'll let a couple of the nicer ones. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> let a couple of the nicer ones play out. My, uh, so the, one of the reasons I'm streaming tonight is because I, to get to the secret endgame stuff, I really need to complete all the, all the campaign, all the story. But I've been wanting to at least stream and let the story online mostly as an archive because I mostly just play all my games to, to archive stuff uh, and as you can see three uh, 393 397 399 and these printers are gonna be like 80 72 so like I've been this guy is all about having very large numbers and grinding and getting lots of XP uh, which is I've been doing it's just there's only so much I can do uh, without continuing the story forward. If you're, uh, if you're ever interested in an RPG where there is just a lot of game, the Disgaea series is definitely it. So there's the campaign, and you can just go through these levels, and you can replay old levels to uh, to sort of grind or get more XP. This, so... <laughs> the, uh... The re oh, reason I'm playing only the campaign part is because I'll go and I'll do, like, Item World or... Uh, de or Demon World Explorations. I'll do all that off-stream because I believe I'm currently at 180 hours in this game. And if I'm only streaming four to six hours a week, it's like 180 divided by six. I've had a little bit of soju, so that's hard to do. Obviously, that's 30. I should have known that. That'd be like 30 days of streaming, so 15 weeks. So if I were only playing this game on weekends and streaming it, I would be this far, like mid-May, assuming I stream every weekend. And I would say a lot of this game is quite boring. Like, me going through one level and doing it a hundred times so I can get, like, 500 levels for somebody. No! Dude, I, I can't multitask and be interesting enough to make that fun. So, I'm sure some people can, but I don't think I've ever seen anybody play through all of Disgaea, plus the secret boss, on stream, uh... In a way that's like entertaining or fun to watch. Yeah, me, I'm surprised you got through all of all of Fate of Resonance, to be honest. Not because you can't finish a long game, just because yeah. I think it's hard to like set a stream schedule where you have one long form story game that you're gonna complete on stream. No, you d I you haven't finished it yet? Why are you playing? Okay. No, I'm not going to say anything. I thought you moved to carry on and I just missed your, like, end of Fate stream. You will finish Fate of Resonance. I know it's... I know you will. You'll do it. One cool feature of 5 is everybody... Most of the main characters have these overload abilities. Which I think this will just kill everybody. Oh, it did not. Oh, I can't attack up there. This is the worst. I'm really sorry, Teddy. I'm a, I'm a fake fan. I honestly thought you had finished Fate.
I'll turn in my membership club card. Uh. Oh no, thank I, Teddy. I was very surprised. I'm always surprised to see people that I follow stop by and stream. Like I said, even if it's for a minute to say hi, it's greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. You have a great night. I will catch you on your next stream. I hope other people check her out as well. Teddy's good people. Congratulations, Usalia, Christo, and Peta on getting top three. It's a hundred million light years too soon for a printy to disobey me. Hey, sis, I fought back because I had no choice. But no matter how you look at this situation, it was all your fault. Wait, where are the bad guys here? The printies got upset because they weren't getting paid. And then we killed them all. What happened? You're acting different. If you have a problem, don't hesitate to tell us. Aren't we your allies? Sir Kilia. I think... <sighs> if only I could just throw away my shame, reputation, and everything else, and jump into Sir Kilia's arms. Yeah, right now she's just ashamed because all of her facade has melted. I wish I could just die in Sir Kilia's arms. Oh, please don't wish for that. Ah, uh, we haven't defeated Marjorie yet. Margarita. This will make it very simple to take complete control over the entire Netherworlds. I keep wanting to call Margarita Marjorie or some variants. Because Rhapsody Musical Adventure is a great game. Can the ritual be performed now? We should have brought her back outside of uh Disgaea 2. Nothing is impossible for you anymore, Lord Void Dark. However, taking the worst case scenario into account, I think you should absorb the last spear's energy. Very well. You've gained so much power already, and this might be insignificant, but... No. Failure is not an option. We must be fully assured of success. Oh, we're back to the lasers. You gotta love the lasers. Would, uh... Would you be opposed, Abby, to me trying a second Soji flavor? So long. Oh, no. Is she going to betray her father? She ran away from home and brought home a These are like 12% alcohol by volume. Has backfired. And they're smaller than a beer. Hey, you guys! Our guests will arrive soon. Take good care of them. But take extra care when handling my daughter, Serafina. Okay. Is this... This isn't gonna autoplay. Hey guys, get out of the way. Actually, I'll wait till we get to the next map and then I'll do it. Hey Sarah, looks like these jabronis want to fight us. Just for the record. See. So he's already made the next move. Baja blasting her isn't a. Uh, like this. It's not an innuendo. We got some Baja blast and cans that are available here, so.
Snowju time. Let's go. This is a Jinro Soju, and it's a grapefruit flavor. Looks like it's Korean. Usually not a big grapefruit fan. What do you mean? Our objective Ooh. is to destroy the final magical spear. We will not tolerate anyone standing in our way. It's uh it's light it's a light grapefruit with some other fruit flavors in there and it's quite refreshing. Uh, just trying to figure out the map here. So yeah, we got people like in the the three to four hundreds, and then we have some characters I recently created, Remy and Izul, and then obviously my main character Kilia. Let's go. We can just show what we can he can do here. Those numbers are surprisingly low. This okay? uh, can I get at least the first three? Yeah. First three at the blast. Not all killed. Yeah. Boom. I guess not all guaranteed to be killed. Who can do attack boosts? I'm actually trying. No. You can, perfect. Let me see if she can boost uh Braveheart, yeah. We'll boost Usali's attack. And maybe this Prinical meter will actually or Prinical meteor will actually do something. Better. My God! Did you pick her up again? Damn you! You hate to see it. Kind of pot committed to finishing that one off. I'm not gloomy. I should clear everybody but the two Rue grapplers up there, which are quite annoying sometimes. Uh, knockouts. Who did I leave? Who's left over? Oh, there's one guy back here. Okay. Kind of wish it didn't pull me out to that different UI view specifically for firing the lasers. That's an awesome powers okay. reference. Congratulations, Kilia, Peta, and Usalia on top three. I can't keep going like this. I have to tell them all the truth. But I can't. What am I thinking? What do you think they'd all say if they found out that I'm four now? But I don't think I can keep lying. If they're going to find out sooner or later, then I should tell them myself. 
No, I don't think I could stand them treating me like a poor person. They'll pity me for being poor and laugh at me for being poor. I wouldn't be able to stand that. But I can't obey my father and let him sell them out to the lost. Uh, I just want to die. Hall of the King. There it is, the magical spear. Oh, what? Wow, Straining everybody's energy. Super it's weird. Thought. It might not be stuck in the ground, but it's still absorbing the energy. Let's destroy it, Blit. Quickly. No, everyone. It's a. What? Crap. What is this? I can't move. Damn it. How did I fall for such a simple trap? We came here to save this nether world. Why are we being treated like this? You've fallen into my trap. How is it, my guests? How does it feel to be captured in my overload skill, Rigid Rope Gallows? Damn, that's a good overload skill. Ugh, I'll super destroy the overload of an overlord who was so scared of the lost he retired! Overload skill! Super Universe! Useless. My rigid rope gallows has a limited range, but once a prey has been captured, it cannot escape. What are you trying to do? We came here to save Gorgeous by destroying the magical spear. If you want to save this nether world, then stay calm and sacrifice yourselves. If I turn the rebel army over to the lost, then they'll probably give me a lot of cash. Right, Serafina? You're gonna give us up? What's he talking about, sis? Talking about be being a jerk. Force my daughter to speak the awful truth about Gorgeous. Very well, I'll tell you. Gorgeous has gone bankrupt. We have lost all the wealth that we once had, and we are now poor. Poor Blitz? Well, that's an obvious consequence of investing so much money in this sturdy shelter. So, what's the problem here? So she doesn't have a ton of money. You being poor? I was born, raised, and continue to be a proud poor person. Whether you're rich or poor, you're still Serafina. It doesn't change your status as our ally one bit. Serkilia! What was that? Oh, 
Iris's body is... Serafina is growing. Dun 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 The bryonic goes. I was such a fool. I always thought that being the wealthiest in the entire universe was where my true value lied. I thought I wouldn't have any value if I became poor. But that wasn't true. It was just my boring pride trying to convince me of my worth. Thank you, Sir Kilia. Thank you, everyone. I can see that clearly now. Hey, Serafina. Are you going to betray your father? Overload skill. True Brionac gaze. G -g -g -got him. Now, father, release my servants. No, my allies from your trap. Yes, ma'am. As you desire, Madam Serafina. Serafina, what have you done? Do you have any idea what you've done? We're going to be poor now. You were complaining so much about not wanting to be poor. Father, will you listen to my feelings? Please stop being ridiculous. This all happened because you're a coward. If you weren't so cowardly and were more defiant, then you wouldn't have bankrupted us by investing in this shelter! Father, you're the cause of all this! You coward! Father, I'm not afraid of being poor anymore. I have all these brilliant allies by my side. Serafina? The lost are here? The rebel army. We're here to take your heads. Got him. I am far from a vain person, but I very much like the way my, uh, my PNG looks. I just feel like saying those words out loud. I'm doing her strength, but I'll never let anyone feel pain. Let's go. Uh, what is it? Leave it to me, Grant. Everybody's just far enough outside of range. No, she's tiny. And the heal other healer's tiny. Shoot him McGavin. Okay, do we have another healer left on here? Christo. Espoir, silver play. Arigato. Hello, yeah. How did the uh, how did the end of uh, your Apex stream go?
Did I not type your name in right? I must have typed your name in wrong. I'm bad at typing. Third place after our fourth party. That's Apex. Do you remember back when Apex didn't have shield swapping? No, no, you're not from you're not from Louisiana. You're from Iowa. That's what the IA stands for. Remember? We talked about that. Was uh was today a planned stream or was I just not paying attention to your schedule? Okay, yesterday it wasn't. I remember I think it must have been yesterday I was like, wow, she is uh she's on right now. I'm also very relieved you're able to get like reliable wired internet up to your Seraphina. up to your room. Are you sure about this? And I know you're worried at some at some point about like audio from the house getting into your stream. But like the entire time you've been streaming the last like few days, I've not heard anything that hasn't been from your microphone. So it's probably annoying to you because you can hear it, but nobody on stream does. Can you accept that? <laughs> and hopefully your dad doesn't run into your room doxing your name and social security number and birth date all at the same time. But I was only able to realize that thanks to my allies. Financial wealth and materialistic satisfaction are only temporary. Besides, if I seek happiness from money and possessions, I'll never be truly happy. I realize that now. I really want to get back into Apex, but I don't think I'll have fun unless I have, like, a dedicated money and few people that I can play with. Make you happy, huh? Do you have, like, a... <laughs> oh, you have one of those signs outside of your door that says when you're live? Is it an actual... Like, is it a light up one, or you just like put up some paper? You've got great allies, and now you can count yourself as a proud overlord. Live your life as you see fit. EA's stream is done in front of a live studio audience. Father. I, for some reason, I thought they made like relatively cheap, like USB, like live, like signs, which are essentially just like a light box for like 10 or 15 bucks, but that's also 10 or 15 dollars that you could put toward something else. Seraphina. Let's take a quick peek. Especially you. I'm not endorsing Amazon by any means, but something like this is like 27, and that's fancy because you have like a remote. It might be tough holding on to my daughter's reins, but please take care of her. Something like this is like USB powered. Yeah, okay. As an ally. You could get something like that if you wanted. Father, allow me to show you how much your daughter has grown. Or like throw it up on your throne and maybe somebody will get it for you. Or both, I don't know. I've been reading today that 
Sony's really been doing uh, some shit when it comes to anime streaming. Funimation is finally... Is something wrong, Lord Void Dark? The Funimation streaming service is finally getting shuttered. Anything that you bought on that is just poof. And they're doubling the Crunchyroll subscription. The final spear has been destroyed. It must be the rebel army. Damn. I'll get rid of them right away. I'm never gonna say, like be on stream and say somebody should definitely commit a crime. I've already but there is plenty of ways that you can yes, get a stream of an anime to your screen that doesn't involve paying Crunchyroll. I mean, there is so there is High Dive is the only other competition I can think of, and they're relatively small in the U.S. and they. They're more like, I would say they're more older, and maybe less hype stuff than Crunchyroll has gotten licenses for. <laughs> every every time somebody does an acquisition or a merger, and they talk about competition, like they're like, oh no, but like, you can. You can watch anime on Netflix, and you can watch, you can rent stuff from Google Play and then and Apple. So there's no competition, and we're just a little guy over here. We're just trying to, we're just trying to make it. The Demon Emperor finally begins attacking all the Nether Worlds. The final battle for us, the Overlord Rangers, starts now! Ooh! Awesome! I'm so excited! Our final weapon, Grand Gorgeous King, will crush Void Dark along with his netherworld! We've done it! We are victorious! That was fast! Peace has been restored! Now, let's go, my lovely Seraphina, on our sweet honeymoon! Everything's moving super fast! You're jumping too far ahead in the process of love, Blitz! Next time on Tyrant Squad Overlord Rangers, Episode 15, The Honeymoon Explosion! Mine and Sir Killia's memory will be spun! Please cancel this show. <laughs> exactly how it happens. It's funny, because she did jump to Episode 16 and run... Episode 14 now. This is. Also, Microsoft spent years convincing regulators that we have to buy over. We have to buy Blizzard. There's no way this company can survive. We're the only ones you can keep them afloat and keep them intact and whole. The and Three months after it closes, massive layoffs. Should be illegal. Should be a dissolved. Uh, Acquisition at that point. Gorgeous reborn. Gorgeous says colossal underground shelter that my father constructed was modified into a mobile fortress. And I don't even buy the argument that oh, they would have been way worse if you know Microsoft didn't buy them. Like the whole point, the, the whole point of an acquisition is to convince everybody that's better for the markets, and a big company buying another big company. It's generally not that. I, I see. In Game industry is very poor. You could simply escape by flying away. My father's cowardice has finally proven useful, but this gorgeous reborn isn't meant for escaping. It's for attacking. That's crazy, sis. I'm getting excited. I want to see Microsoft do well because I, they were very pro. They've been very pro PC games the last couple years. And having a game on the PC. Too. Let's super break into wherever Boy Dark is right now. I want to let Red Magnus finish with that. But having stuff on PC is a very good path forward to having good preservation going forward. So PC is just a great platform for that because if it runs on Windows x86, Windows like is so backwards compatible and sort of breaks so slowly moving forward. Uh, I'm pretty confident that games that you buy now that don't require like online servers, like 
We'll be able to run those in 20 or 30 years. Just like we can run DOS games from 50 years ago. Or uh, 40 years ago? 40 years ago. But what I what I don't like seeing is like just games not get made because you need to buy up competition to Do you know where he is, I don't know, make slightly more money. Yes. There's no need to worry about that. I've pinpointed his exact location using my clairvoyance. And Sony obviously doesn't have that sort of push towards PC gaming. But And Nintendo definitely yes. doesn't. Void Dark is currently surrounded by heavy security and countless numbers of lost soldiers protecting him. And they're not ordinary demons. They are elite squads made up of individuals who have the potential to be overlords or Majids. Uh, are you serious? Oh, I'm starting to get stomach cramps. I don't think we've met any Majids in this game yet, have we? <laughs> definitely not Majin Boo. What are you scared of, Zero? This will be a if I can make my own Majin, I will name yeah, him Majin Buu. But I'd like to avoid exhausting myself before our fight against Void Dark. Kilia is right, Blip. We need a great idea in order to dodge our way past their security, Blip. <laughs> dodge their security? Why are you guys thinking on such a small scale? We can simply barrel through them with Gorgeous Reborn. Seraphina! She seems completely unbound, Blip! She overcame the reality that she feared the most, becoming poor. I'm pretty certain nothing will scare her now. <laughs> Arrows, guns, point dark, bring them all on! Episode 15. Episode 15. The Ultimate Skill. There it is. That's the netherworld where Demon Emperor Void Dark is currently at. Dark Demise. This is the final fight. All right, let's go. Please wait, Sir Kilia. Before that, we need a harbinger. A harbinger? Prinnies, prepare for anti-netherworld combat. Open fire! Pew, 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 pew. Aye, aye, dude. Hey, Serafina. Let's get rid of the excessive small fries first, okay? Small fries? They have the potential to be overlords or margins. Madam Serafina, it's ready, dude. Great job. This is Serafina, no, actual. Features so bright they gotta wear shades. Uh. Are we finally gonna do a bloodless fight? Time to relax. Every more martial training. 
better parts. Uh, I was just reading ahead some spoiler-free guide. Uh, we got trophy. We have got data. Total play time. That's nice. Allies defeated nine. Perfect. Uh, there's a bad ending if I have 50 allies defeated. In the Sky of One, it was like more than five, like two or five ally kills would get you the wrong, the bad ending, or not the uh, the not best ending. Do people do speedruns of Disgaea 5 complete? Disgaea 5. Any percent no DLC. Includes anything from the female royal NPC that must be must redeemed from her. And this is an this game takes an hour to beat. What have I been doing? Three hours to defeat Ball, and this isn't New Game Plus. I'm at 180 hours right now, or so. Some uh, some RPGs I've seen yeah, have like new game plus speedruns, which are like just you blasting through overpowered, which could be fun. I've also seen some speedruns for Wild Arms 1, which apparently like there's some item, there's like some special glitching you can do to bypass areas, which like isn't surprising in its own. It just, I don't follow Disgaea or not I don't follow Disgaea or Wild Arms or really many speedruns. Uh we'll still have Killia more martial training. One percent doesn't sound good. How much will it cost to buy this? Let me thank you. Great. Oh. Yeah. Let's give them money. Let me thank you. Third martial trial has been made. These martial trials are like the castle or cave of ordeals from previous games. It is a good place to Let's uh, fix you up. to do training or other sorts of grinding. Uh, a bunch of bullshit that I don't care about. My strategy worked. Oh. My strategy worked. It's gonna be hard to like this. This series has had some like really fun moments for me. Like Chicken Pirates was a good one. Can't forget Chicken Pirates. Drill. 
Can we not get rid of that one that easily? I know he's a boss, but... Got him. Almost. Almost got him. Knockouts. Or just the... Here, sir. There we go. Top shot these. Dance if he wants to. Okay, I got him. Congratulations, Adele, Geese, and Aaron Dare. This is gonna be the uh I blew up their blew up their over overlord planet, right? Counter? Beautiful of you to no. Face. Won't even bother countering. Why would I? No, my strategy worked. But I will have a healer here, surely. Wow. These guys are so much lower. I need to start popping them in for future fights. I think we're past the Send them on expeditions and hope they stay caught up level wise. Got him. What a joke. And we got 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 him. My strategy worked. Yep. World shattered. Be happy, huh? Nin nin. Nin nin. Let's wait until that one finishes up. Then I'll redispatch people. Trying to do it in cycles. Let's fix you up. Ignore that playtime. It's a lot of playtime, I don't want to talk about it. Where would you like to go, dude? Do the 
the thoughtless collision Madame Serafina caused, we are physically connected to your destination, dude! Now, there's no point of having a dimension gate, dude! I just cut out the hassle. Now, everyone, let us head out to our final battle! Uh... What's wrong, Usalia? Achilles curry before the final battle blitz. Huh? But Usalia, wasn't your spell lifted? Yes, that's true. But I want to eat that curry one last time because it was what allowed me to meet you all. D don't say this is going to be the last time. But she's got a point. No army can fight on an empty stomach. I'm in. Achilles Curry. Yeah. It's making me drool just thinking about it. Ooh. I think I'm starting to get hungry too. Uh, oh my. How unladylike of me to let my stomach growl. But to save my hunger and appetite, Sir Kilia? All right. You're all requesting curry? Curry all around. Or I guess chili. could make me so happy. Yeah! <laughs> I'm glad you were able to find happiness in the little things that are right in front of you. Happiness in the little things. I never expected to hear something like that coming from you, old man. What's going on? This relaxed feeling before the final battle. It's caused by the trust we have in each other. I really want to thank you guys. Without all of you, I would have... There's no need to say anything more, Sir Kilia. After all... You have saved everyone here. She's right, bro. All for one and one for all, right? No, I don't think they are, Abby. That isn't something a demon should say, but... Yeah, they did bring up boy love at the beginning of this. It's all right. well, I believe that was between... Red Magnus and Kelia. All right, I'm full from eating all this delicious food. Now, let's go out there and fight our super final battle. Lise, everything, everything is about to end. Let's go. I'm probably not going to finish the final chapter tonight. But we're going to do a few more missions. Got to so give people something castle. to come back to. Yeah, it definitely is. Yeah. It certainly looks like the kind of castle a super final boss would have. That's Desko's castle. My, there are survivors? They're tough for small fries. It seems that they aren't small fries after all. They look like normal lost soldiers, but their potentials are over 2,000% higher than usual. Over 2,000%? Is that even possible? I would say no, but it's actually happening. 
They're all elites with the potential to be overlords. Be careful. You're all overlords too, Flint. There's no way we're gonna lose. That's a super great point, Lil Busa. She's right. There's no way we're gonna lose. No, but... We don't have time to assess the situation. Let's go. Some more bullshit ships. We have a spawner. Okay, so I need to My strategy worked. Need to put somebody there. the range I wanted. Oh my god, all these monsters are at my low levels. I kind of hate to see it. Here I go. Get him, geese. We'll just end there. Just double checking, they're just those two spawn stations. We're now uh, taking the airship route. Gooms. It's fine. He's not going to take a ton of damage. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Like, I'm like, I don't need to hit you that much. And that will counter. Charted up. I'm just going to let you keep running. Mm. 
Should have checked that that wasn't like a uh, no entry zone before I started moving, huh? Oh, I didn't finish that person off down there. Excellent. Rip you a new one. strategy worked. Of course she was gonna need help over here. There's just some characters I have that you look at them and you're like, you just you're just never gonna be the closer. Congratulations, Agent Jesse, Aaron Derzy, and our magical knight, Ray Earth. We need a little more help on that. What the? They vanished before we could finish them off! They overheated. They unleashed too much potential power, so their bodies must have broken down. These enemies are serious. There's nowhere for them to retreat. But why do you guys look so deadpan? The real fight's about to begin, right? Y you're right. We're invincible as long as we have Sir Kilia, who has mastered the ultimate demon technique final skill. No, my ultimate demon technique isn't complete. Although I'm able to use the final skill, I can't defeat Void Dark yet. I don't know how I know, but I know it. I'm missing something. Kilia, it's all right, Clint. Even if you're missing something, we'll fill the gap. Yes, especially if the gap is in your heart. I'll fill it up personally. No. Your thoughtfulness is all I need. You don't have to carry everything on your own, Kilia. Really, what's yours is mine, and what's mine is mine. That was it, right? No, you're completely wrong. It's all for one and one for all. Yes, if we all work together, we will have tremendous strength, Blit. However, I understand why Kilia is worried. Void Dark uses the ultimate demon technique too, so they both know each other's abilities. But if there's a secret skill of the ultimate demon technique that Void Dark isn't aware of, we might have a chance of winning. Yeah, that's what I've been thinking. A final skill that surpasses the final skill? Is that even possible, bro? I'm not sure, but Lise once told me something like this. Kilia, want to hear something good? Yep. No, I'm fine. No, tell it to me. Um, but it's about my father's secret. His weakness. Tell me. It's not a weakness, but I have heard that there is a skill that even my father wasn't able to master. You're telling me there's a skill that even the great demon fist Goldion couldn't master? Yes, it's a final skill that surpasses the final skill. He said it's called the ultimate skill. Does such a thing really exist? Maybe. I don't know. But he said 
that the ultimate skill protects the people who are precious to you. A skill that protects people. Isn't that kind of weird? Protects the people who are precious. <laughs> Worthless. That has nothing to do with me. Really? Then you wouldn't protect me? The ultimate skill protects the people who are precious to you. Hmm. Precious people. That may be the key. But the people who are precious to Bro are... It's me, of course, right? It's all of you. Unfortunately, it's Lise, but... But mostly Lise, yes. I know. I just wanted to say that. <laughs> <laughs> you just voluntarily stepped on a landmine. You are a super M, Sarah. An ultimate skill that protects the people who are precious to me. But I couldn't protect Lise. Does that mean I don't deserve to master the ultimate skill? After, uh, I think after this one, I'm gonna wrap it on up for the night. I got a bowl full of peanuts to finish up. And you don't want to hear <laughs> on screen. When I was in the Lost, rumor had it he was at the top of the castle. It's normal for the person in charge to be on the highest floor, Blitz. Everyone, please don't forget that we have to face Demon General Bloodus before we face Void Dark. We need to free Master from his brainwashing, but the final skill of Vidya Holy Water doesn't work on him. Right, bro? Yeah. But I owe Goldion more than I can ever repay. If only the... Oh, I know! You can lift his brainwashing by using the ultimate skill! What do you mean? You're stuck at a dead end because you're limiting your list of people who are precious to you to only Lise! Doesn't the ultimate skill protect the people who are precious to you? Then just add Bloodus, I mean Goldie, onto that list. I see. Lise has passed away, but Goldion is still alive. The final skill didn't work, but maybe the ultimate skill will. That might help, Master. You're awesome, sis. We've got to try it. Hey, Sarah. Just say that so Killian would forget about his ex. How rude. Not just Princess Overlord Seraphina is not a woman of such low caliber. Sorry, I just had to ask. Red Magnus, didn't you know this was going to happen? Yes, Blip. Protect the people who are precious. Is Goldion? You must be the rebel army. I am the overlord of Roaring Rampant, Beharidas, former member of the Ten Ashura Kings. Do you think you could defeat the survivor of a battle royale bloodbath against my brothers? 
who obtained the title of Demon General! I'm something of a battle royale or myself. This guy is a Demon General too? Is it just me, or does he look weaker than Majorita and Gladys? Don't underestimate him. He's unleashing his potential excessively too. Let's get on, boys. Let's see. Can I have somebody of higher rank throw you? Let's go. Just in case. Huh. My strategy worked. This is not going to kill them, but half damage. Got him. How long does your sniper shot work? That's long enough. Just hold shift or control. Perfect. I should get one of those big uh, area healing spells. Keep going, hmm. I said team attack with her, for the love of god, she needs this. <laughs> Those healers are really buffing them up. Oh, two kills. You'd love to see it. Hmm. I don't think I can uh, make one of those night boards yet. Night, boys. Champion of the day, boys. Masters of karate and friendship for everyone. They're so musically talented. A lot of people don't believe that about me. Because I'm not. Let's just blast some extra healing.
knockouts. Let's see. Let's, uh, start zorping. Just like watch this movement. It feels so good. Watch it. Great. Oh my god. Let's go. I have to do an action, so makes me do that. Just that whoop whoop that it does. <laughs> I can't tell you how much like playing this game for like 160 hours and then having a character just just literally just zort me to where I need to be. Like how... Like what a feeling of power that is. They really did a good job on that. Congratulations Kelia, Ray Earth and Adel. Not that Adel. His overlords like crap. Ugh, makes me sick. He's huge. He's so big. I'm going to repeat myself. He's huge. This is the Overlord of Brutal Beast, Grand Gradrius the Sixth. That's impossible. Rumor has it he was killed by Void Dark. How are we going to fight this thing, Blip? Sir Kilia? He's a great opponent to practice the ultimate skill on. But, but... Don't worry. I'll master the ultimate skill to protect the people who are precious to me. I was only able to get to this point because you guys supported me. So, it's my turn to protect you guys. Amazing! That was simply amazing, bro! Defeated that beast in one hit! One punch, man. Whoa, whoa, Kilia! 
Are you trying to compete with me over the title of Strongest Overlord? Sir Kilia, were you able to get any clue on how to do the ultimate skill? Yeah, I kind of got it. But it's not enough. Protect precious people. More than one person is precious to me now. Isn't that right, Lise? Ba -ba -ba -ba. We have to uh, leave distribution B for another day. Thanks everybody for stopping by. Like I mentioned, I wanted to uh, mostly wanted to unlock a little bit more of the story. I got that third uh, third dojo for training done. We're uh, part way through the what I think is the last episode of the game. If you're uh, not already watching my YouTube, I would recommend checking that out. I have clips for a lot of FPS games and multiplayer games that I will not play on stream and then clip up some mediocre to somewhat enjoyable moments that I find. Uh, and those will all go up on my YouTube. The, uh, the Twitch VODs will live on YouTube forever or until they start charging me for videos that I upload. And if you're watching this on YouTube and you want to check stuff out live as it happens, like uh, this Disgaea stream, you should uh, check me out over on twitch.tv slash nmjohn. This uh, coming weekend is Super Bowl Sunday, but uh, on Saturday, and I think for probably part of Sunday, I'll be doing the uh, Digital Devil Saga playthrough. I've been doing a good job. I uh, gained a few more levels off stream and uploaded that as a VOD to YouTube. So hopefully on Saturday I won't get immediately destroyed trying to do the most trivial thing in the game. But I just want to knock out these little story bits before uh, I sign off though. And thanks again to everybody who stopped by, who lurked, who said hi, who watched VODs on Twitch or YouTube later. It's appreciated. I see numbers go up, just like in this game. And they make me happy. Help make my numbers go up. If you're seeing this, you're already making those numbers go up. So you're like, I'm, I'm, doing, I'm doing my part meme. All I'm saying is, if you don't, if you don't share this video with five friends and make them watch it to the end, then you will have one year of bad luck, and uh, and they have they have to share it with five friends. You don't, you don't want to have bad luck for 2024, do you? Okay, everybody, thanks for the stopping by. Thanks for watching. Have a good rest of your week. Bye. 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 Bye.